spoolful here showing off my last uh, project just getting this one wrapped up for now this is uh, actually my daily driver so it's pretty nice for daily uh, trucks a 74 Chevy three-quarter ton I've owned this thing 25 years um, yeah it's a nice truck um, I'm the second owner uh, this is put a lot of miles on this thing it gets beat to heck but just did a little restoration clean some things up here um, some people buy a new truck every 20 years I just kind of redo this one so serves my needs uh, we did this in-house kind of had to fast track this one uh, it was about a two month little restoration we didn't do paint on this I did that about 10 years ago but um, just went through kind of suspension hadn't been redone in a while um, really didn't do anything on the inside that was I got a new steering wheel and we're getting the seat redone but um, it's a big glass truck I'm gonna pop the hood here Let's see if we can get this hood open with one hand without shaking the camera too much uh, truck is a 1974 the front clips off a I don't know 88 or an 89 so the truck living in California here is smog exempt. I can do whatever the heck I want, and obviously I have. But a um, little small block, 383 stroker. Puts out about 470 horsepower on the dyno. About the same on torque. Just got it fired up. Got the Edelbrock Pro Flow 4, their latest generation. Just put the Be Cool fans on there. It's about a $1,200 deal with dual fans and harness and everything, but want to keep this thing alive I'm trying to think what else here exciting uh, trucks got a 700 trans with four-speed automatic redid the fuel system uh, wall bro pump what I tried to do everything that was Chevy I tried to keep just have it re sandblast and repainted rather than buying brand new shiny Chinese stuff I say crap here but doesn't fit uh, I mean every little bracket every just re Played it, even the motor mount bolts. Uh, tried to keep it as Chevy original from 74 as possible. And I think it did a pretty good job. There's some stuff that I just couldn't handle, like the brake lines with the little curly cues on them and stuff. So I wanted to upgrade to stainless and do something a little better. But uh, like I said, this is a daily. Um, and it's going to get beat to heck, but uh, it's not going to look this good forever. But uh, anyways... There it is, my latest build, and um, yeah, I got plenty of projects lined up after this one, but uh, there it is.